Hello, hello, everybody. It's your prof Jeff, and we're back with more 4chan drama things. Okay, this is 4chan versus Scientology uh, by Pezzle. Let's go. The only thing I know about Scientology is Tom Cruise. That's all I know. So let's see what's up with Scientology. Scientology was so insane that it sparked a brutal war between some of the most powerful entities. Oh, it's a church as well. Kind. kind of. It paved the way for 4chan's Anonymous to become one of the main voices of the internet. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. Expect us. I mean, come on, brother. Okay, okay, like, okay. And it uncovered some of the deepest and darkest okay. secrets of the Church of Scientology. I mean, they're pretty. Both they're, organizations they do things, but did their finest on. to defeat the other, but only one group in the end could come out and actually say they were victorious. Strap in, because this story right, will going take back us on a to the wild past. ride that will rewind time back to, the back to 2008, when things were simpler and Project Chenology was on the horizon of being the good old days. Was it good? I don't remember. I was too young back then. Something Not great. that young, but you know. What is Scientology? Video by Pesle? Pesle? I don't know how you pronounce that. Maybe Pesle is right? Chapter 1, Scientology. Okay, what is Scientology? We're gonna find out, I guess. The Church of Scientology would be enigmatic for many years, enigmatic. stealthily staying quiet outside the spotlight of the general public. Although Scientology would soon be- It's really weird though, because church and science, they don't really go hand in hand, you know, because- Become a common yeah. household name, when various top tier celebrities and high profile Wait, individuals- who is this dude? He's very familiar, but that bald head and not familiar. Began to get intertwined in the group. Tom Cruise, Tom Cruise, a well-known A-list celebrity, got deeply involved within the Scientology community. Okay. What made it interesting, though, is his need to share his love for Scientology and religious awakening with the world. A religious awakening. Tom Cruise became Scientology's biggest advocate, although people began to question his sanity when he would have these bizarre appearances. <laughs> he quickly made headlines across the globe during his appearance on The Oprah Show, on Oprah. embarrassing himself in one of the most unique ways possible. First of oh all, thanks God. for coming to my Legends Ball with Katie. Was that the best fun? Was that? Yes, yes. What has happened to you? The hell was that? <laughs> We've never seen you behave this way before. I know. Have you ever felt this way before? Okay. <laughs> he homies on the good shit. Okay, that's all I can say for that. That is the behavior of somebody that is. He has bought some of that high quality shit. Check his nose, here? please. Is there <laughs> white powder yeah. there? The okay. again. <laughs> I'm a hugger. Hey, Tom Cruise. Hey, yo, yo, brother. Brother, the old age is bad. It's, it's over, brother. You can't do that shit no more. No, I mean, yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Women have rights yeah. now. Stop it. Yes. Yeah. You and can't just you touch him like that. You've been hugged. <laughs> Even okay. though he quickly became the laughing stock right. of the internet, it only seemed to make him more sporadic and unreasonable. Tom this Cruise was thought of himself as awakened. I mean, listen, based on how famous Tom Cruise is, this did not do much to his image, right? Because home is famous as hell even now, as especially he now, right? His experiences with the movies he's been doing. He even explained this in another plane regular movie. interview. I think it's a privilege to call yourself a Scientologist, and it's something that you have to earn. And because Scientologist does. When I read it. Okay, that, how how many of my life savings must I donate to earn that, right? Oh. And, you know, I just went, this is it. This is exactly it. <laughs> <laughs> I looked at them, <laughs> you know, and I thought, oh, I don't know. Beautiful thing, because maybe one day, don't know, Chris. it'll be like that. You know what I'm saying? Maybe no, one no, day, I don't. it'll be like <laughs> that. SPs, like they'll just read about those in the history books, you know. <laughs> you know, it's rough and tumble, and it's wild and woolly, and it's okay. Messed. Listen, I don't uh, have they been cutting up this interview, or is homie just saying words at this point? Like, is this a cut up interview, or uh, I don't know, I have no idea what he's talking about. It really is fun. What part about it? 
Explain, you psycho Even though Tom Cruise helped fuck. bring Scientology to the mainstream media, its teachings were still unknown to the average person. Teachings, okay. There was one Let's more final teachings. push <laughs> that really got people to understand what Scientology was all about. Why, why is he getting a medal? Is that a Scientology medal? What, what is going on? I'm more confused. South Park? South Park? Okay. South Park released an episode called Trapped in the Closet, Trapped. which was essentially dedicated to making fun of Tom Cruise and the Church of Scientology. Oh, Although this gave the public exposure to the unusual ideology Celebrity that Center. Scientology was fundamentally built on. Which is? The producers of South Park thought the beliefs were so insane that they even had to put labels on some parts of the episode. This is what Scientologists read, actually believe. This is what Scientologists <laughs> actually believe. Is it that bad? The episode wound up Damn. being a massive success. Nine point one. That that's that's about Even as high to as you can go. Park episodes, which are all also wildly successful. This Started one in South particular Park. is ranked in the top ten South Park episodes Damn. of all time. Oh, yes. oh, I thought Soon, this was in two thousand eight. All walks of life that now knew what Scientology was all about. In a vast majority, I don't know what it's about. We don't know shit. Brother, what is it about? I know Tom Cruise is there. That's what we know. Ridiculous. Give us this the info. episode was the birthplace of all types of Scientology memes, needs your which money. would make Scientology even more of a mockery than it already was. People on the internet were even creating websites that made fun of Scientology and its beliefs. <laughs> One of the main actors on the show, hey. Isaac Hayes, would condemn South Park. Damn, that guy has a big ass head. Is his head too? What? That's a Mark long making head. making fun of his religion, which was Scientology. This controversial clash would catch the attention of news agencies, making this specific Ice. episode Ace? blow up even more than it already did. There's that did. one set that rants and intolerance and bigotry towards religious beliefs of others begins. Okay, well, listen, the, the thing with most religious is they're, they're old. They're old as hell, right? Scientology, that's actually new, brother. Can you just make a religion? Can I just make a my religion now? That blessing, motherfuckers? Like, is that like how it most works? fads on the internet, it was just a matter of time until rap. the Scientology memes and disdain were to fade away back into obscurity. Mm. Although, this is where the Church of Scientology made a fatal mistake. One which would cement itself as one of the biggest missteps in internet history. Ooh. They decided to do the unthinkable and fight back against the internet's fun. They claimed that some of the photos used in sites and forum posts DMC. infringed on their copyrighted material and demanded that it be taken down. They even got some of the Tom Cruise videos taken down from YouTube, claiming that they were both pirated and edited. Scientology then threatened legal action against anyone who defies them. This would only anger the internet, deepening yeah, good luck fighting the internet. the animosity towards the Church of Scientology. Websites and forum posts were still taken LOL down, aliens. some out of fear of litigation and others by force. Although the internet was working overtime, what is this? and the speed of new hey, content yo, I'm would seeing be some too words fast that I can't pronounce and shouldn't pronounce handle. anymore. On screen. Chapter 3 Darkness. Brother, we still don't know what they do. Why? I... Hey, maybe we'll find Maybe he's building it up. He's building it up, okay? Soon, a change in atmosphere around the subject of Scientology would occur as one specific website would come to fruition. Come? This website was called the Unfunny Truth about Scientology, and instead of memeing or making fun of the religion, it goes over- Most of you know the premise of Scientology and Rufus about Scientology- No, we don't! We do not! We don't! Over some of the more serious controversies- It's a dangerous cult. Ruins lives. The website lives. is essentially Chaos. a video slideshow of some of the church's misbehaviors. Okay. Along a fragilent messiah, L. Ron Hubert, is a convicted of fraud and sentenced for his imprisonment, has stolen 200 million from the church. He died in hiding a fugitive. With some of their extreme beliefs. Okay. One the belief in policy. particular is that anyone who isn't part of the church should be injured without. Okay, maybe the private property ownership by means by any Scientologist without any discipline of Scientologists may be tricked, sued, or lied to or destroyed. Yeah, but there's laws. You can't do that shit. <laughs> no matter how the much you believe, you can do that shit. You just can't do that shit. Had after getting involved in Scientology, and, and all the deaths seem to be deaths. pointing towards Scientology. Right, listen, bro, this is not the first religion with stuff like this, okay? I, I won't name names. I won't throw out shit because I want to start shit in the comments. But 
If they ain't the first religion to try and do shit like Some this. wrongdoings. Probably won't be the last. Lisa McPherson was a huge donor to the Church of Scientology. She is an active, active member of the church paying thousands of dollars per year on audits and self-improvement courses. Self she was later courses. brought to a hospital by the Church of Scientology after staying on their grounds she for some time. For they made sure to take a long detour to find a hospital with a Scientologist doctor. When she finally got there, she was pronounced dead with cockroach bites all over her body. What? I didn't even know cockroaches bite. I mean, oh, yeah, they bite, but how would they bite you? What? She was also underweight, extremely dehydrated, and with multiple bruises. Okay, police? No Joseph police? Joseph Havneth. Wait. There's another unfortunate. Okay, we're just gonna ignore that. The police didn't do shit about it. A Dutch man. Of Germany. the Church of Scientology. After being prescribed, one day the hotel guest noticed water seeping into the carpet from under his door and note on his door said Brett's sleeping. Prescribed unknown medications and checking into a hotel to visit one of the main churches, there seemed to be flooding coming from his room. He was later found dead in the bath after multiple days with burns all over his body. The water was supposedly so hot that it burnt right through his clothes. What? There was but one note. Whoa, how does that even happen? Water so hot it burned through his clothes. Outside his room, that solemnly said, sleeping. His head was not underwater, but he was the drowned. The website also details one of the grim ways Scientologists usually fund their organization. Which is? They would extract all or most of the money from their victims, selling them packages to quote, oh, help them. I've heard about cults and uh, stuff. There, it actually happened to a woman here. My grandma was telling me. So she joined this cult. And when you join the cult, you sign a document that Pretty much after some time or if something happens to you, everything you own becomes the cult's property. And later on, she became kind of normal after years, but she lost everything. So shit happens. It happened in my town to a woman here. I and mean, that's America, brother. America crazy. Um, the victim would either fall into their own demise or the Church of Scientology would do its best to make sure there was no one left after their money was fully extracted. That's Whether crazy. that be they die or get absorbed into the organization. Okay, yeah, but like, then they have a police. It's not a lawless country. People didn't notice this. Or they that rich and that powerful that no one can do anything. I, this this is website that illustrated that the Church of Scientology was pure evil. And that they would be getting away with both murder and the destruction of people's lives. But how do they do this, especially without getting caught? Yeah. They would use scare tactics. And most importantly... Leagues of highly qualified legal teams. That's scary. That Essentially, is, that is probably scarier than the the killers. Fucking lawyers. Saw themselves as untouchable. Good well, lawyers. So they thought. Oh, but they were touched. Oh wait. Hey yo. The four chan. Can't touch four chan. They've already been touched. Four chan soon skits. caught wind of this website, along with oh, all stop, the stop. censoring <laughs> Scientology was attempting to enforce in the internet. Uh, One anonymous user was upset. Hey, yo. Hey, yo, what is going on this part? That this was going on without any repercussions and wanted to use the power of 4chan to do something about it. I think it's time for B to do something big. B. People need to understand and not to fuck with B and talk about nothing for 10 minutes and expect people to give their money to an organization that makes absolutely no fucking sense. I'm talking about hacking or taking down the official Scientology website. It's time to use our resources to do something we believe is right. Inspirational it's time speech to do something big again, B. Talk amongst each other, find a better place to plan it, and then carry out what can and must be done. And must it's be time, done. B. I mean, hey, listen, sometimes they do the right thing, but the way they talk is, oh, yeah, it's kind of crazy. Hey, yo, you believe a little too hard in some of this crazy shit, but sometimes they do the right thing. Which is, I guess, what this matters. This post was met with some backlash, as many huh? users on 4chan thought this was mission impossible. The Church of Scientology was simply just too strong. They had money, lawyers, and power. I mean, yeah, Along but... with this, there was a growing divide within the 4chan community. Some of the older users only wanted to troll for a quick laugh, while the other new users wanted to use 4chan's trolling oh, for the betterment of society. Even with a fragmented community, the thought of war with Mission Scientology impossible. marinated in their heads. On the very next day, another post would be uploaded, but this one would be much stronger. On 15-1-08, war was beginning. Scientology site. This is what I mean, brother. Like, 
Hey, I, I'm all for this, but like, come on, bro. The war is beginning. It's, it's already it's not under really heavy bombardment. A war. It's loading quite slowly, but this is just the tip of the iceberg. The first assault and many to follow. We're winning a minor victory, but without the united support of the Chans, Scientology will brush off this attack, and it will be doomed to nothing more than an entry in ED. 4chan, answer the call. Join the, Join the Legion against Scientology. Help in its demise, in its long awaited So dramatic. Doom. For decades, this tyranny has existed, corrupting the minds of the weak. Although hilarious, it's rather- Has it been decades? I don't know. We've never been told. They're pathetic. We must destroy this evil and replace it with a greater one. Chanology. Chanology. For when we are victorious, the Chans will stand united in a new chapter of anonymous existence and batshit insanity. We will have begun our world takeover. If we can destroy Scientology, we can destroy whatever we like. The world would be but our plaything. Do the right thing. Brother, this guy went from, hey, yo, we must do the good thing, fight the good fight in one little message he went from doing the good thing finding the good fight to being hey yo brother you are worse now what are you doing chill the fuck out for chan <laughs> become not just part of this war on, become man. an epic part of it the largest of the chans you hold the key to manpower say what chance, the legion please. is in desperate need of forward anonymous oh my God. united we are legion we are unstoppable mm -hmm. tldr we're taking down scientology <laughs> join up or gtfo this call to action more, and announcement of rest, war brought the 4chan community together for a common cause. Instead it. of the wild speculation from the day before, now the community was fired up and ready to absolutely That's destroy what got the fired of Scientology. Up, is it? Soon after, a video was released oh, by Anonymous on February 15th, 2008, publicly declaring war on the Church of Scientology. Hello, leaders of Scientology. We are Anonymous. Over the years, we have been watching you, your campaigns of misinformation, your suppression of dissent, your litigious nature. All of these things have caught our eye. With the leakage of your latest propaganda leakage. video into mainstream circulation, the extent of your malign influence over those who have come to trust you as leaders has been made clear to us. Anonymous has therefore decided that your organization should be destroyed. For the good of your followers, for the good of mankind and for our own enjoyment, we shall proceed hey, to expel hard, you from the internet and systematically dismantle the Church of Scientology in its present form. I mean... I, 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 okay, uh, the drama is flowing again, Soon, but the music Soon, everything associated dead. with Scientology began to feel the intense wrath of 4chan. Did they? Their websites were under heavy DDoS attacks. Okay. Unpaid pizzas and taxis were sent to their buildings. <laughs> their call centers were even hit with the music rich. of Rick Ashley. And they even received faxes of black pieces of paper to waste all of their ink. <laughs> Scientologists were flustered. Since the attacks were anonymous... <laughs> I like how before this we were talking about destroying them, annihilating them, and... We send them pizza and we use up all their black ink. I mean, that's I get it, but come on, coming man. from people from around the globe, <laughs> there was no clear target for their lawyers. Uh, yeah. Some anonymous users even attempted to go incognito mode and infiltrate the church's ranks from the inside. Oh, shit. Although these intrusions weren't necessarily physically harmful, it was doing some damage to the mental state, patience, and operations of the Church of Scientology. The Cult of Greed. 4chan seemed to have found a weakness in their armor and was continuing to attack the Scientologists with full force. They made it so that when someone searched up information on Scientology, they would be met with links that would describe it as dangerous <laughs> or a brainwashing cult. Damn. There was one glaring issue with 4chan's various attacks. Without a serious plan, their continuous aggression would never create a big yeah, blow just to minor Scientology. Annoyances. A lot of them, would but... only be more of an annoyance than anything. What they needed is a leader, someone to push them in the right direction, to inflict maximum. Is that what they need? Uh, are you sure that's what they need? Adversary. That's when Mark Bunker of Xeno TV, who is also an anti-Scientology activist, made a video addressing 4chan. Bunker shared his extensive knowledge of how to do some real damage to the Church of Scientology. Okay. Instead of 4chan's disorganized offenses, Almost been the he recommended specifically where they should focus all of their efforts. Hi, this is Mark Bunker from Xenu TV. I've been hearing from a lot of members of Anonymous and a lot of other people asking me, well, what do you think about Anonymous? First off, I, like I think dude. it's incredibly exciting to have an army of young, passionate why. people wanting to do something about Scientology's fraud and abuse. It really is exciting. However, I think you're making some major mistakes that that 
are going to hurt in the long run. It may seem like fun and games, but Scientology is serious, and you have to be prepared. You shouldn't be doing things that are illegal. You just shouldn't. You can say, well, you know. Brother, it's 4chan. Anonymous. I mean, but that's how they operate, though. Well, we're all anonymous. It's hacking get shit. Us. If they get one of us, there'll be 10 other who, who stand up. Well, that's good for Hydra. you, but how about the ones who get caught? Yeah, about uh, that. I am concerned about that. He's like a nice guy. You can keep attacking their websites and keeping their sites down. You, you may be able to do it for weeks or months. You, uh, you're not going to keep them off the net forever. But a better way to attack them would be Jet get rid truth. of their tax-exempt status. How That's do you do that? Them. How do you do that? It sounds wait, dull. Wait, so they're they're actually a church? Because I know only churches get that shit, and only in some countries. I think in most countries actually, which is absolutely fucking stupid. If you ask me, but whatever, nobody asked my ass. Uh, That's damn, hurt them. It's crazy. Going out. I would expect Tom Cruise, motherfucker, not getting taxed. Handing out leaflets. I saw a couple people in in a video in Manhattan the other day who were doing that. Wonderful. That's wonderful. Speak out. Be strong and and do it smart. Don't don't do things that are illegal. Don't be a okay. Uh, I got After the M &M video lyrics was found in my on 4chan, head. Mark Bunker would receive the new nickname of Wise Beard Man Why? and was taken in with open arms as commander in chief for this battle. 4chan decided to take Wise Beard Man's advice, oh and soon God, real life protests man. began to be planned. Not long after. 4chan's Anonymous released another video. Oh god. Be very wary of the 10th of February. Anonymous invites you to join us in an act of solidarity. Anonymous invites you to take up the banner of free speech, of human rights, of family and freedom. Join us in protest outside of Scientology banner. centers worldwide. We are Anonymous. We are Legion. We do, not, forgive. Centers we are do there. not forget. God we will damn. be heard. It was finally time to show the world the monstrous things that Scientology okay. has done. Please and show as us. the date approached, users throughout the internet spread the news. Soon, many internet enjoyers from various communities would temporarily right. join the ranks of 4chan to help in efforts to fight Scientology. The Church of Scientology would take these threats extremely seriously. They released a multitude of statements regarding the video and the planned protests alike. What did they say? This weekend, we do anticipate that some members of the group, Anonymous, will turn up, as they have announced. We take this seriously because of the nature of the threats that this group has made publicly. We will take every step necessary to protect our parishioners and but staff, I've never as well heard as that members of the community, life. in coordination with the local authorities. As to our knowledge of the organizers of the event, they are yes, cyber, cyber terrorists, terrorists who hide their identities behind masks and computer anonymity. Anonymous, alleged free speech, justification, is believed by the fact that the video in question has been seen by millions. It is Anonymous that has repeatedly attempted to suppress free speech through illegal assaults of the church websites, as to prevent internet users from obtaining information from the church. They have also engaged in other harassment, including threats of violence in telephone calls, fax <laughs> transmissions, and emails, and not to mention- I bet they also said they'd fuck your mama. Mentioned the anonymous mailing of white powder to dozens of our churches, white requiring the services of law enforcement. Religious bigotry of any nature is deployed. They definitely know white powder in that church. Trust me. And profoundly affects the entire community. The hate crimes of anonymous should be condemned. Hmm. Were they though? The Church of Scientology did its utmost to label the internet goers and Fortune's Anonymous as cyber terrorists. They wanted to get ahead of the curve in case the protests the actually occurred, especially if it would eventually reach mainstream media. They wanted to frame themselves as the victims to sway public opinion in the I mean, they kind of doing that and they're doing a decent job of it. In their favor. I don't know, Along even if they this, aren't, the organization they also got wanted convinced to people, people that they are. ...from actually coming to the event in hopes the protest would be just another internet flop. Fuck is that? Although, unbeknownst to them at the time, it was yeah, already too go. late for the Church of Scientology. Oh shit. Their efforts would prove to be unfruitful. Scientology is much more dangerous. Newsstand's Dan Klein reports some spent the day in protest. Hmm. <laughs> the police do not look intimidated at all. <laughs> That's a lot of people.
They seem to be having fun. <laughs> Did that do anything, though? This is not about the personal beliefs and ideas of Scientology and the people who practice it. This is about the ethics that the management and the people the face. in charge of Scientology practice. This is for Lisa McPherson and everyone else who's died at the hands of Scientology. We are anonymous and we're protesting the illegal actions of Scientology Church. We have no problem with their beliefs in and of themselves, but we... Bro, you can't say we're anonymous and put your whole ass face in the camera. Where is the, where is the mask, god Don't damn it? Want to, uh, support their illegal Not very anonymous. activities any further. The event was a massive success. Oh. Around 7,000 internet users from around the world in a hundred different cities gathered near Scientology buildings okay, to that protest does not seem that much. and to shine some light upon some it's, of their wrongdoings. A lot of people, Most of them wore Guy Fox masks to show their allegiance to 4chan's anonymous group. <laughs> Even after the initial protests, hey, there would be plans to continue for the next few months. These other protests would also be successful, with a planned protest happening a couple times a month. The Church of Scientology did its best to fight back. Batman? They hired private investigators to dox some of the protesters, and they attempted to Yo, sue that various sounds individuals illegal. that Wait, were wait, wait, that sounds illegal, goddammit. You can't they just dox people. They would also lure protesters onto the Scientology property to get them in trouble with the law for trespassing. They even slashed tires, destroyed property, threw eggs at protesters, oh. and Scientologists All of which even went as illegal. far as supposedly killing one of the protesters' pets. What? Although, luckily, many of the Scientologists' Fuck. attempts to get protesters in trouble with the law would prove to fall short. Scientology endings. Endings? Is there? Is this a multiple ending game? What is going on? Endings. Overall, Project Chanology was a massive success. 4chan's elite group, Anonymous, was now on the horizon of becoming something notable in history. Okay. They were mostly known for their trolling. Yeah. But now, society saw them as much more than just that. With Chinology, uh, Anonymous, which <clears throat> collected uh, different individuals on the internet, they organized to engage in a more traditional activist endeavor. And this was in, in 2008, where that transition from pure internet pranking to a kind of irreverent activism was born. Along with the development of the group Anonymous, yeah, Project Chinology wreaked havoc on the Church of Scientology. Instead of allowing Scientologists to continue to operate in the shadows, the protests brought Scientology to the main spotlight of the media, <laughs> which is what the church wanted to avoid at mm. all costs. Along with this, the public saw Scientology as a villain, which would create an everlasting bruise nice. on their reputation. Even though the Church of Scientology's members were declining since the protests, they still possessed some of their tax exemptions, uh. which is the lifeblood of the organization. As Shit. Mark Bunker, or Wise Beard Man, once said, if you take away the Church of Scientology's Axis, tax brother. exemption status, that's when you really do some damage to them. That's probably the only reason Anyways, they started. thanks for watching. Wait, if that's it? Oh, man. I thought it was going to be more brutal. I thought more crazy shit was going to happen. God damn it. Anyway, let me know what y'all think. Have you heard about the Scientology thing? I haven't really. I still don't really know what the hell is the whole ass thing. What are they trying to do? What are they believe? We didn't really get that from this, but eh. I guess we got what 4chan did. They accomplished their goal. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe. I'll see y'all next time. Bless everybody. Bye.